Okay, in this video, I want to show you uh, real quick how to run a troubleshoot script um, on the GoPy Go or uh, one of our robots. Uh, if you're seeing this video, you've been instructed to go here probably on the forums and just quickly ask you for some diagnostic information. Really easy. We've got a, if you're running Raspbian for Robots, our operating system on the desktop, you've got this test and troubleshoot icon. A uh, little guy wearing a hard hat and a wrench in his hands. I'm going to go ahead and open that up and you'll see this nice GUI here. Um, you'll see that in the background you've got test and troubleshoot a um, command line program running in the background. Don't close that command line. If you run the, uh, in this case I'm going to do this for the GoPy Go, but uh, you can do this for the um, Grove Pi as well. Basically, I'm going to run a few tests on the GoPy Go with it um, with it installed and running. This is going to generate a log that we need you to send back to the Dexter Industries forum. This will make it easier for us to figure out what might be going wrong if you're having some trouble with the GoPy Go. So we pulled the test and troubleshoot up. I'm going to run troubleshoot GoPy Go and. I'll get these warnings, so make sure the battery pack is connected. Check, I've got that. I've got the GoPi Go upside down so the wheels are in the air for the test. That's that's great because we don't want it running off, it's gonna run motors, we don't want it running off the edge of the uh, uh, desk or anything like that. And finally, I'm just gonna click OK uh, to begin and we'll see a few things whiz by and we'll run through all the tests. Hit OK and See, we're doing some tests. So this is going to run quietly in the background. Um, it's not uh, not frozen yet or anything like that. It's just running some things that you can't see. You hear the motors start running. Now they're running the other way. Motors are running again. There you go, I get this message saying complete. All the tests are complete. The log has been saved to desktop. Please copy it and upload it to our forums. So I click OK and then I'm gonna exit the program. I click exit. Under log.txt you see on the desktop this new file has been generated here um, called log.txt. And this has got all the information that the engineers at Dexter Industries want to see. And you can either upload it directly into our forums or copy and paste the text and paste that into our forums. It'd be easier if you did the uh, upload file uh, way. And that's it. That's how you run a test on the GoPi Go um, or, or GrovePi with the Raspbian for Robots operating system.